This video is about exactly what the title says it is. The Anaheim Angels of Los Angeles, or whatever the heck you want to call them, are a complete joke. It's like a circus show. It's just funny at this point, and I'm not even being sarcastic. Many people are upset about this Angels team, understandably so. And it stems from far before 2022. The Angels have had the best player in baseball for a decade now, yet have no playoff wins to show for it. Only one appearance, one in which they'd of course get swept, and that was eight years ago. Ever since, Mike Trout has continued to be Mike Trout, the best and most consistent player in the game by far, yet the Angels haven't sniffed October. So what did they do? Sign Japanese phenom Shohei Otani, a man who can hit well and pitch well prior to the 2018 season. The Angels missed out on the postseason in 2018 and 2019, so what did they then do? Signed star free agent third baseman Anthony Rendon to a seven year deal, and that's when this legendary tweet came out, one that would predict the future. It wasn't that hard considering the Angels had failed to build a winning team around Mike Trout and now Shohei Otani. What makes us think another great hitter is going to really change things? Rendon is great, or at least he was, but what the Angels need is pitching. 2020 came and went as it was a lost year, but 2021 featured Shohei Otani winning the American League MVP award after finally having a full season of hitting and pitching, doing both exceptionally well. This had to be it, right? This had to be the year. Well, no, the Angels finished eight games under 500 and basically made a meme out of the 2021 draft earlier that season, using every single pick that they had on a pitcher. Seriously, not one position player was drafted to the Angels in 2021. I'm sure some strategy went into it, but what it looked like was the front office just throwing a ton of stuff at the wall to see what will stick in a couple years. The injured Mike Trout and Anthony Rendon only played a combined 94 games, and Albert Pujols, another great hitter on a big contract who was also declining for years now, was released earlier that summer. So, beside Otani, there wasn't really much to cheer for, but wait till 2022. Mike Trout and Anthony Rendon will be back fully healthy along with the reigning MVP. Some money was thrown at pitching, everything should be fine, right? Well, the Angels did start out 2022 strong. In fact, we're one of the best teams in the American League. They were winning a lot and everyone was happy about it, not just Angels fans. Us fans of baseball want to see Trout and Otani in October on baseball's biggest stage. It has to happen. And it was looking like this could finally be that year where it does, except deep down inside, every fan saw the elephant in the room. The thought that this very well may not last, and it of course did not. The Angels went on to lose 14 straight ball games. 14. In the midst of that losing streak, their manager Joe Madden would be fired. And then they soon found out that Anthony Rendon would be getting season ending surgery on his wrist. The Angels have played 12 games under 500 since the beginning of May, 10 games under 500 since the beginning of June, and at the time of this video being made, are 14 and a half games back of first place in the AL West. It's bad. As a fan of baseball, seeing Trout and Otani in the postseason would be incredible, but the Angels continue to show how hard that is to ever happen. If you want a perfect summary of the Angels in recent years, well here you go. In a pretty recent game against the Kansas City Royals, Shohei Otani went off, hitting two three-run home runs and driving in eight runs. The Angels lost the game. In an even more recent game, this time against the Chicago White Sox, Mike Trout and Shohei Otani hit back-to-back -back home runs at one point. Otani went 3-for-3 three for, three for the game, and the Angels lost the game 11-4. And in the most recent game where an event like this has occurred, the Angels were taking on the Houston Astros, and Shohei Otani hit an absolute bomb in the first inning for his 18th homer of the season, giving the Angels an early 1-0 lead in Houston. The Angels would go on to lose the game 8-1. There was also this video that surfaced the internet recently of Mike Trout getting notably annoyed in center field, implying that his teammate was tipping his pitches. Mike Trout knew this, but not any of the coaches whose literal job is to partly figure these things out. At this point, you just have to laugh because there's nothing we can do about it. Maybe the Angels will make a crazy run and find their way into the postseason. But as of right now, it's continuing to look like how it's been for eight years. The best players on the team, guys who are future Hall of Famers, do something great. And sometimes even historical, only for the Angels to lose or get blown out. It's the biggest joke in baseball.